Former Everton chief executive Keith Wynas has claimed relegating Manchester City has to be an option if they are found guilty of financial breaches. Pep Guardiola's side were charged by the Premier League last year with 115 separate breaches spanning over nine seasons. Man City to be relegated? A date has been set for a hearing, which is not known to the public, as for Premier League chief Richard Masters. It is not believed to be until 2025 but City and their 115 charges have been in the spotlight with Everton and Nottingham Forest receiving points deductions this season. On Monday, it was confirmed by the Premier League that the latter have been deducted four points and are now in the relegation zone as a result. Meanwhile, Everton were deducted 10 points last November, which was reduced to 6 points last month after an appeal. The Toffees were handed the sanction by an independent commission after they exceeded losses permitted under the league's profitability and sustainability rules by £19.5 million in the three seasons ending in 2021-22. Fans all around the world are eager to find out how Manchester City, who are going to have better lawyers than OJ. Simpson, will be punished, with many assuming they will get away unscathed because that would be bloody typical, wouldn't it? There has been talk of relegation to League 2 and their titles stripped and speaking to Football Insider, ex Everton CEO Wynas has likened this situation to Rangers who were demoted to the Scottish fourth tier after tax issues. Wynas believes expulsion from the Premier League has to be an option after Masters and co. backed themselves into a corner with their decision to hit Everton with a 10 points deduction. We saw it with Rangers with their employee benefit problem and the tax situation, he said. That was expulsion, and they ended up going down a few leagues. The way it would kick off with Man City would be incredible, we know that. It would be an earthquake. But it has to be an option. The Premier League have backed themselves into a corner by giving Everton a 10-point penalty, which is greater than the punishment for going into administration. Where do you go with something bigger than that? They've left themselves with no room for maneuver.